Hi, everyone. My name's Edie. I'm kind of in my feels today, so I thought I would come and share some thoughts with you. Uh, I've been a Sensi consultant for 12 years. I've grown a team. I've met a lot of people. I've traveled to a lot of places, um, have a great customer base. And what I've seen in like the first three quarters of where I'm at today, everything was very consistent. There was this steady growth, this steady increase, this steady uh, percentage that made a larger business, a larger customer base, a larger team. Um, and it was just this nice, steady increase every year. Saw a little bit of increase every year. And I was watching a video today from May of 2020. And I'm here to tell you that the changes that have come from the pandemic, from so much, like that era has brought a shift like I have felt never before in my life. And I've had some major shifts. But watching that video made me aware that there is a constant for some people, but not for everyone. And just in this video, I watched, there were at least four people that were directors under me that have either stepped away, passed away, um, or just chosen to no longer be a participant in the Sensi world. Um, there are others that have given up. There are some that have thrived. And it really, really made me think today about hanging on. Um, and when you feel like you are struggling, that you reach out, you ask for help. And there are a lot of people in this world that just cannot do that, that you find it very difficult. One, some people find it embarrassing. One, some people find that it's a failure to ask for help. And so they, they tend not to. And then on the other hand, you've got people who are deathly afraid of change. And in 2020, we got a dose of change. Everybody did, right? Everybody did. Um, and I think that it has put a perspective on what's happening in my own personal business um, right now. So in 2020, I not only was dealing with what everybody else was dealing with, I, I opened up a snack bar. <laughs> I opened a restaurant. Um, and in that first year, it did really, really well. And then it very quickly decided that it wasn't going to succeed in this area for multiple reasons. Um, and in 2021, um, the end of 2021, I decided to close it. I decided to, um, you know, beat the failure. Uh, in other words, I, I didn't want it to um, make things worse. So I closed. But in that process, um, I was focusing on something other than Sensi. And so were my team members. <laughs> I am a firm believer that leading by example, showing what you do, um, allowing it to be duplicatable is super important. And I Beca I, I was short of that um, in 2020 because of the fact that I focused on something else. Um, and so what I did, they did. And they started focusing on other things. Um, and so I noticed that shift and I felt that shift. Um, and then once the snack bar was closed, I jumped back in both feet head first um, into this business that I've always loved, that I've always had passion for, that I've always felt super connected to. Um, 
And then now with the whole Facebook banning me thing, I've had to recreate my business in a different form. And so that is huge. That's change. And it just made me think today that, wow, first of all, change is inevitable. How you deal with change is is totally up to you. It has nothing to do with anybody else, but it's completely your power. But also, I strongly believe that those that hang on, those that hold on to the bar and say, I'm not letting go because at some point someone's either going to lift me up or I'm going to be able to fall and only have about a foot to fall to, right? Something is going to give. And at this point, I truly believe that if you are struggling in your sensi business and that it started maybe in the pandemic, maybe it didn't, maybe it started well before, maybe it just started. Um, hang on. Don't give up. Don't give in to the negative talk of what is potentially out there because then you're fearing something that you don't know. And there's no use to do that, right? Um, because I really feel that those that hang on right now are the ones that are going to benefit at the end. Once everything kind of settles, and I'm not saying that we're ever going to go back to the way that we were. I don't think that that's possible at this point, but things are going to settle. Things are going to set in. People are going to accept the change that they have incorporated into their lives and allowed new things to manifest and transform them, right? So I really feel that if you hang on and you ride the wave, that good things are coming. Good things are coming. Um, and I, I just wanted to share that message today because I feel like we are all in a space of change. We're all in a space of upheaval. And that can be very difficult for some people to, to deal with. Um, some people are pros and masters at it, um, at change. Not everybody is, right? So just hang on, have faith and know that what is on the other side of this is going to be magnificent. And I want to be there with you guys, right? So listen, if you want to join Sensi right now, it's a perfect time to do that. First of all, they're giving away a free warmer with the kit. So that's fun. Um, but I want to be able to support you. I want to be able to help you. And I can do that. I can do that. I've got experience to do that. I promise. So if you are interested in joining, um, please do not hesitate to do so. Um, let me see if I can put up my, no, that's not the one I want. This is the one I want. <laughs> um, go ahead, type that in, order your kit, get your free warmer, um, and know that I'm here to support you. I'm here for the long haul. My daughter made a joke about it the other day. She's like, mom, she goes, you want me to take over your business? She goes, I don't ever see you retiring. I'm like, eh, well, you know, <laughs> I could be 95 still doing this. All right, guys, thanks for letting me share my feels with you today. And uh, I hope to see you guys on the next video. Bye now.